Hello, everyone. Yes, it is Tuesday. Good to be with you. And uh, we have had a very busy week, as you know, uh, with the fall bash. And, and I don't know uh, what it was, but maybe I am just getting old. And I haven't come to terms with that yet. I don't know. But man, I was so tired this weekend. We, we did not have services uh, Sunday night. And boy, you talk about uh, resting and, and all of that. Uh, of course, Monday uh, didn't hardly do much of anything, and and uh, but anyway, um, I uh, hope hope and pray that you're doing well, and and of course we got the ladies uh, ladies uh, conference this 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 weekend, uh, Friday and Saturday. So hope hopefully, ladies, you're ready uh, for that and geared up. I think it's going to be an exciting weekend, and so we're praying for you, ladies, and hope and pray that God will speak to your heart. But anyway. Well, you know, on the lines, I tell you, it has been, uh, it, my schedule has just been turned upside down with uh, our grandson, our first grandson, and boy, you talk about excited and, and just so thankful and, and uh, in more ways than one. Can I tell you how, uh, how excited I am? Uh, not just because of uh, Beckham, but but so proud of my of my daughter, so proud of her her and her husband Matthew, and very thankful for uh, you know them, and very thankful for how God has blessed us, and and of course, obviously Beckham is just uh, uh, another blessing, and but you know with them being in our house until the, in our house, you know, waiting for their house to get ready. Um, you know, it's, it's, our schedule's been so messed up and, uh, but I tell you, I, I catch myself just, you know, thanking God for what he's blessed us with and very thankful for just, just all that God has done. And, you know, my thoughts went to this verse and I, uh, I think after I read it, you'll, you'll probably, you know, you that are, are familiar with the word of God, you've probably heard this before, but but boy, I tell you, it's such encouraging. The Bible says in Psalm 37, and notice if you would with me in verse 25, I have been young and now am old. Now I can identify with that. Now I don't know how old is old, but I am much older than what I used to be for sure. I, I was young, now I am old. But, but David says it like this, I have been young and now am old, and yet have I not seen the righteous forsaken, nor his seed begging bread. You know, what a blessing it is to be able to live a long time and have a testimony for God. To have a relationship with God where you can say, because of your experience, because of your walk with God, you know, I've never seen God unfaithful. I've always seen God do what he says he would do. And oh, I tell you, God is so good. And I hope and pray if, if, if there's a young voice listening to me today, may I challenge you and may I encourage you, what a blessing it will be for you to be faithful to God right now, starting now, and be faithful at every turn, at every step, learning to walk with God, learning who God is, and finding out that God is good. It's so much that, that you wholeheartedly follow him and serve him. You won't go wrong, and you will find that God is faithful. So today, Christian, may I encourage you no matter where you're at in any stage of life, let's be faithful to God right now because God will be the God that is always faithful to every generation. He will do what he says and you will find that he'll be a blessing to you. So maybe you've been away from God. Maybe you've done your own thing. Can I tell you? Let's get back to God right? You, you that are faithful and you, you could, you know, what can you say, but amen, because God, you know, God is good. And you're so very thankful. 
You, we pray that our that our children will follow God. We pray that our uh, our grandchildren will will not only know Him but love Him with all their heart. Let's continue to be faithful to the Lord. Well, may the Lord bless you today. We'll see you tomorrow. Father, thank you. Thank you, Lord, for just the opportunity of growing old. Thank you, Father, for what you have given us. And Lord, may we all, no matter where we're at in, 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 the, in the stage of life, help us to be faithful to you. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you. We'll see you later.